Hey guys, I just wanted to show you really quickly how to change the color of an SVG font in InDesign. There is kind of no easy way to do this anywhere, but especially in Design, it's extra uh, unfriendly to SVG fonts. So the best way I found, maybe it's not the right way, but the best way I found is to add an inner shadow. Um, and use that color to take over everything. So the way I'm gonna do that is I'm gonna select my text here and I'll go to effects. And if this isn't in your window, just go to window, effects. And with our text selected, we're gonna select text here, effects, inner shadow. And from here, we're gonna change the blending modes as well as our color and the size of this inner shadow to just kind of have it take over the inside of this shape here. So I'm going to go to hard light for my blending mode. Let's just for example's sake change the color to this cyan, 100% um, opacity and you can kind of see it start to fill in now. Um, from here we're just going to increase the size until it fills it up. So I'm just going to put, I don't know what this, uh, how these Pika's units measure. <laughs> um, I feel like I'm making a fool out of myself with all this pronunciation. So correct me if I'm wrong. Um, but I'll just increase the size until it's big enough to fill it. Um, and you may not get a perfect color match. Um, it's not, it doesn't look like it's too far off, but if that's the case, you can also potentially increase the brightness a little bit to um, adjust your hue and saturation a bit there to make it feel a little bit more, uh, a little bit closer to the color you're looking for. Um, but you'll see you still get to keep that texture in there with this method of doing it. So that's how I would do it. I've also seen that you can change the color in Illustrator and then place the text into InDesign, but this is a good local way to hack the color change um, for your SVG fonts. So yeah, hope that helps.